around September this year, nag-upload ako ng first video ko dito sa YouTube which is about Course Hero, an online tutoring platform kung saan ako kumita ng more than 200,000 pesos. I am doing this part-time and if interested ka to become a Course Hero tutor, ilalagay ko na lang ang link ng video sa description box below to guide you on the application process. Meron din akong part 2 video regarding sa tutor dashboard walkthrough tutorial. Ilalagay ko na lang din ang link below. Now going back, nung nag-upload ako ng first video ko about Course Hero, that was also the time Course Hero initiated an update sa platform nila para magkaroon ng SMS verification before mag-withdraw ng earnings. For some tutors, wala naging hassle sa platform update na ito. Luckily, I was one of those na walang naging problema sa update na ito. Though may nakita akong post about this on Course Hero Facebook page last September 17th, I was also clueless kung para saan ang update na ito. So, not sure kung anong mobile number yung ilalagay ko. Parang ang nangyari is you just have to try and do the verification process and see for yourself kung paano ito gumagana. Ganun yung naging experience ko the first time na mag-try ako mag-withdraw after the update. Let me know in the comment section if parehas tayo na naging first-hand experience with this update. For some tutors, naging stressful yung verification process sa kanila kasi hindi sila makareceive ng verification code sa mobile number na in-enter nila. May ibang tutors pa na nalock yung account nila kasi may limited attempts lang para mag-set ng mobile phone number. This was the time na na-flood yung first video ko ng mga questions on how to resolve this verification issue. Kaya ngayon, I am doing this part 3 video about Course Hero, focusing mainly on the SMS verification process. If interesado ka malaman about this recent update, I hope you stay tuned and watch till the end of this video. Hey everyone, this is Nori Rances and I do videos on personal finance, tutorials on how to earn, save, and invest, and life updates and interests. If you're new here, please do click on the subscribe button and the notification bell para lagi kang updated whenever I upload new videos. On November 15, 2022, nakareceive ako ng email from Course Hero with subject, Important Update, Complete Your SMS Verification. Na-excite ako kasi finally, mariresolve na yung issue na na-encounter na ibang tutors with their account. May impact ito sa pag-withdraw ng earnings kaya naman ay understand kung bakit na stress yung ibang tutors na naka-encounter ng problem with the verification and withdrawal of earnings. Kaya naman, in this video, I will walk you through the step-by-step -step process on how to complete the SMS verification at sasagutin ko din yung ilan sa mga frequently asked questions nyo regarding this topic. Para saan nga ba yung SMS verification na bagong feature ng Course Hero platform? Ang goal ng Course Hero is to provide a high-integrity platform where tutors can safely and securely share their knowledge and expertise. Kaya naman, with this goal in mind, nare-require na nila lahat ng tutors to complete the SMS verification process for security purposes para protected yung accounts natin and also yung earnings natin. I know the transition period for this update has been hard for some tutors, but let us trust the process kasi para naman ito sa security ng mga accounts natin. And also, if you are encountering issues on your account, don't hesitate to send an email to Tutor Support Team kasi nagre-respond naman sila. Minsan nga lang, it could take days kasi depende siguro sa volume ng questions and queries na nare-receive nila. Starting November 14, 2022, para maka-withdraw ka ng earnings, kailangan iset up mo muna yung mobile phone number na gagamitin mo for your Course Hero account. Please ensure to remember which phone number you use sa SMS verification as you will need this phone number in the future. So to start, kapag nasa tutor dashboard ka na, i-click ang earnings tab at marerederek ka sa My Rewards page kung saan makikita natin yung mobile phone number field. Visible lang ito kapag may available balance ka sa account mo. I-select natin ang country code sa drop-down list. Piliin natin ang plus 63 for Philippines. Next, i-enter ang phone number. Sa field na ito, dapat walang country code, parentheses, hyphens, or spaces. 
This field should only contain numbers. Wala din dapat a zero sa beginning ng mobile number. Say for example, a mobile number mo ay 0912345678. Dapat i-enter mo ito as 9123456789. I-double check mo kung tama yung country code at mobile phone number na na-enter mo. Once you have checked your information, i-click ang send code to request for a verification code. May marireceive kang text message with a verification code. It might take 5 to 10 minutes para makareceive nito, pero based on my experience, real-time naman yung receiving ng code. Kapag nareceive mo na, i-enter mo lang ito dito sa code field at i-double check kung tama. Wala din dapat itong parentheses, hyphens, or spaces. Dapat numbers lang. Kapag okay na, i-click ang verify. Kapag wala kang nareceive na code, pwede ka ulit mag-request for another code after 60 minutes. So isang code lang per hour ang pwedeng i-request. Para i-recap, ito yung mga bagay na dapat nating iwasan on the SMS verification process. In the phone number field, don't type in your country code, parentheses, hyphen, spaces, or any special character when entering your phone number. And yung country code must only be chosen from the drop-down list. Don't type in any leading zeros at the beginning of your phone number. When entering your verification code, don't type in parentheses, hyphen, spaces, or any other special characters. Your verification code should only contain numbers. Next, wag sunod-sunod yung request for a verification code. You can only request one verification code per hour. So if you have received an error saying you have requested too many codes, please wait for an additional 60 minutes before requesting for another code. Don't attempt to connect a phone number to multiple tutor accounts. Remember, only one tutor account is allowed per person. Now, tapos na natin ang SMS verification, pwede na tayo maka-withdraw ng earnings. Parehas pa din yung mga threshold on withdrawal. Ang minimum ay 20 US dollars at ang maximum naman is 250 US dollars. And allowed lang ang one withdrawal of earnings per day. In my account, meron na akong 31 US dollars na pasok naman sa minimum threshold na 20 US dollars. So now let's proceed to withdraw this amount. I-click ang withdraw money. Dito makikita natin a notification that our payout withdrawal has been initiated. May marireceive ka ding email in your PayPal email address notifying na na-receive mo na yung payout from Course Hero. Pwede mo ring i-check sa PayPal dashboard kung na-receive mo na ito. Katulad ng na-mention ko kanina, marami ako na-receive na comments on my videos about Course Hero na na-lock out yung accounts nila due to many invalid attempts on the SMS verification. Sa ganitong instance, pwede ka mag-send ng email sa tutor support team para ma-address agad nila yung concern mo. Now, once na set up na yung mobile phone number sa tutor account mo, it is not recommended na papalit-palit ka ng phone number na ginagamit for SMS verification. Pero kung valid yung reason mo for doing so, pwede ka mag-send ng email sa tutor support team at i-check nila kung eligible ka para baguhin yung mobile phone number na nakaset up sa account mo. So that's it for this video. I hope you find this video helpful and informative regarding sa SMS verification process sa Course Hero platform. If you have other concerns regarding this update, please don't hesitate to drop an email to Course Hero Tutor support team or join the Course Hero Tutor's Facebook page para ma-raise mo yung concern mo and have a healthy discussion with other tutors. If you want more videos katulad nito, please hit the like button and comment down your topic suggestions. Please also subscribe to my channel and click on the notification bell para lagi kang updated whenever I upload new videos. See you in my next video. Bye for now.